Hi, this video will explain how to use the discipleship Bible study materials at First Bible Baptist Church. This is the main screen. There's three different kinds of uh, lessons that you can study here. Big picture lessons, one-on-one -on -one lessons, books of the Bible, word cloud lessons. You can also click in here and search for a term or go to a verse or a passage of scripture on the Bible Gateway. And you can send feedback to me by clicking here. Let's start with the big picture lessons. Okay, here's a map of the big picture Bible study. This map includes the Old Testament, the New Testament, and how they are linked together. It also includes an introduction, which we'll go through real quickly. <clears throat> There's also a one-page diagram of the whole course right here by clicking on that button. You can see the big picture. It starts here. A few questions, events, people, places, and times. The Old Testament's on this side. The New Testament's on this side. Uh, here we have 12 events, the main characters, where these events take place, when they take place, the timeline of the Old Testament with the books showing, the link between the Old Testament and New Testament in terms of prophecy, the idea that the Old Testament is revealed in the New Testament and the New Testament is concealed in the Old. Here you see the events and people, places, and books of the New Testament, the different eras of the church age, the harmony of the Gospels in an alphabetical listing of events in Jesus' life, um, the stages in the book of Acts, the journeys that Paul took, and Revelation, the prophecy, and how that breaks down. <clears throat> okay, if we look at discipleship, evangelism, and worship, the purpose of that is to bring people that are outside to the inside and also to make them leaders in the church. Evangelism, discipleship, and worship are explained in the Bible in various places, but here's Matthew 28, the Great Commission. When they saw him, they worshipped him, but some doubted. That's the way it is today. And then Jesus' command to go, which is evangelism, and teach, which is discipleship, and worship, which is obedience. And then it explains in Matthew also what vain worship is, teaching for doctrines, the commandments of men. The FBBC church mission is to love God, love people, serve others, and tell everyone and this mission statement comes from combining the great commandment, which is love God and love your neighbor, with the great commission, which is go and teach and um, baptize. Okay, the Bible is like a puzzle. You don't know much by looking at these pieces, but if you have a strategy, you need all the pieces. There's only one way to do it right. Sort, search, and compare looking at the box top, find the key concepts, which are the edges, corners, and colors in a puzzle analogy. It takes time, but it's rewarding, and it gets easier as you go. Here's the uh, theme verses for this study. It's profitable to study and to teach. In 2 Timothy, this is Paul's advice to Timothy, and the Bible says you err not knowing the scriptures. Strategic questions, Rudyard Kipling said, I keep six honest serving men, they taught me all I know. Their names are what and why and when and how and where and who. And then here's a, a Bible study on how to study the Bible, search the scriptures, compare, hear and listen, take counsel, prepare, teach, and use the free tools that are available on the internet. These links will take you to the various web pages where you can download the free tools that are available. Okay, so our study of the Old Testament. Here's some words, the top 150 words in the Old Testament. You can see the larger the word, the more frequent it occurs, and I challenge you to make a sentence out of these words. And if you click here, it'll show you my sentence. Here's an overview of the Old Testament, creation and fall, flood over all, Tower of Babel, patriarchs travel, 
bondage in Egypt, the wandering Jew, conquering the land, judges ensue. Three kings reign till all split in two, into captivity, return and redo. The main characters, the time frame, which is derivable from the Bible itself, where things took place and what books describe these events. So going to uh, the first lesson, lesson one, creation and fall. If we click here, we'll get another lesson at a deeper level. And you can keep clicking down or the, the blue arrows mean to go look up a verse in Bible Gateway. The green arrows mean go to a lower level. How is God, how is man made in God's image? Again, you can spend a lot of time on these lessons and go to deeper and deeper levels. Second lesson is the flood, overall, patriarchs, travel, bondage in Egypt, and so on. Then down here at the end, we have an Old Testament map. We have a modern overlay map that shows the various countries today in the Bible region. We have the Old Testament clock, which is what if 12 hours on a clock equals 4,000 years. And you can see the books, and you can see the people, and you can see the uh, various timelines proportionally spaced on this clock. And here's an explanation. And we have a Bible chronology that's derived from the Bible. It comes from Philip Morrow, the wonders of Bible chronology, starting with the year that Adam was created and going down. This is a detailed listing of all the events of any consequence in the Bible and their time frame. Okay, then we see the linkage to the New Testament of the Old. We can click here and see what Jesus said about the Old Testament prophets on the road to Emmaus. Uh, we can click on why the Old Testament is profitable for us. It's an example. We can click on God's plan of the ages and see the various things. And each one of these has something underneath it, too. So you can look up all these verses. And here's some additional references that are beyond chart 69 and 74 of Larkin. You can come down and do that here. Daniel and Revelation compared and the book of Revelation. Dake's plan of the ages. This is a nice chart. You need to sort of shrink it down to see the whole thing and then zoom in on various portions of it. And then Leon Bates has a plan also similar. And these are linked to Bible verses. You can click on those and display the Bible verse. Okay, then we have the New Testament. Overview of the New Testament, top 150 words. Make a sentence, check mine. Uh, we have the harmony of the life of Christ, the alphabetical chronological listing of events, a phrase that describes what that event means, the scripture references and the location. Uh, we have then going into detail, the angel's birth and carpenter events are on a map with his footsteps. And you can see this, it's based on the uh, Thompson Chain Reference Bible. Several maps for each phase of Jesus' life. The books of the New Testament and the foundation of the New Testament. Something to study. We have the life of well, church formation, the events in the book of Acts, the resurrection, resurrection plus one year, plus three years, and the various events that take place in the book of Acts. And we have Peter, Peter's life, his number about Peter, his memories with Jesus, how he became a leader in the early church, comparing Peter and Paul, and his, his encouragement in First and Second Peter. And we have uh, uh, a detailed map of Peter's journeys as well. And then finally we have... Um, Paul's life, various phases of Paul's life. These are all Bible verses that you can click on and look up. And Paul's journeys, his early life. First journey, second journey, journey, journey to Rome. Starting in Jerusalem and going to Rome. 
And finally, uh, Paul's writings. This is an interesting diagram. You have to study it out. Click on the verses. See the linkages between the concepts of judgment, for example, judgment seat of Christ, um, the judgment seat in the various books of the Bible, books of the New Testament, and then the book of Revelation. Chapter 1, chapter 4, the churches, the throne room in heaven, the tribulation period, God's plan, the book of Genesis, and the book of Daniel, comparison. And finally down here we have the book, all these lessons in a book form in a PDF, and we have, question, we have answers to the questions that are presented in this book and in the various lessons. Thank you for watching.